Hey there, what can I do for you? Don't worry. I won't let the search for Griff get in the way of what we're doing. Let's just get back to the task at hand. Is there anything else I can help you with? Okay. How can I help? I do. I've been watching you, studying you closely to see what kind of progress you've made since your training at the hands of Master Zahar. I've seen how you've resisted many temptations and continued to walk the path of the light side. Very commendable, but I'm afraid you might stray from this path. You need to see what the dark side represents in its entirety, for it is what we battle. Only the wisdom of a Jedi Master can truly explain this. But I will do my best to make you understand. The dark side is not simply giving in to anger, a temptation, or to use the force to destructive ends. These things only lead to the dark side. The dark side grows stronger and more insidious the closer you draw to it. It begs you to surrender to it, to release all its terrible power, and it becomes harder and harder to resist. And once you stop resisting, it's too late. It twists you up inside and turns you into a mockery of everything you once stood for. I am no less resistant to temptation than any other. I simply have the benefit of training that you do not. But even the training of the Jedi might not be enough to save us. We need only to look at the atrocities which have been committed by those under its sway to understand the terrible, corrupting evil of the dark side. Millions dead, and far more suffering. What sort of person would you have to become to perform such deeds gladly? Neither do I, and I hope I never do. It's so easy to think that we would never fall prey to such a horror, that we have unlimited control, vigilance, and foresight. If only that were true. The Sith have become powerful because there are many Jedi who've succumbed to the lure of the dark side and joined their cause. What greater weapon is there than to turn an enemy to your cause, to use their own knowledge against them? We are weakened while they are strengthened, so we must harden our hearts and do whatever is required to fight against the dark side, even when the battle becomes wearying. I don't know. The vision of our future is clouded by shadows cast from the dark side. But I sense something ominous lurking in those shadows. But words alone cannot save one from the dark side. Come, we should continue with the task at hand. When the time comes, I only hope we are all strong enough to do what we must. How can I help? Then I suggest...
The Force has given us a, a vision, like the one we shared on Dantooine. Did you see it? Of course. You must have. The Force is strong with us both. Tatooine is known for little but blowing sand. I find it surprising that there would be a star map somewhere in its desolate wastes. A star map would likely have to be within some kind of shelter to protect it against dust and sandstorms. I suspect there are many such caves and caverns hidden in the sands of the Dune Sea. The creatures of this world probably use them as their lairs. No doubt things will become more clear once we discover the star map's location. How can I help? Why? I could not accomplish this on my own. I need the aid of others, especially one who is strong in the Force. The bond between us made you a natural choice. Besides, the events on Taurus proved that the Force wanted to bring us together for this mission. And there is little left to chance when the Force is involved. Is that not enough for you? I admit, there were times that I wondered if this is more than just a mission to stop Malak. There were times when I wondered if this was also a way for the Council to test my own abilities. I wondered if the Council wanted to see how I would help and guide you on our quest. I wondered if they were testing me to see if I was ready to become a Jedi Master myself. And then I realized how foolish such thoughts were. As the Council explained, sending a Master in our group would only have drawn unwanted attention from the Sith. The fate of the galaxy is at stake. The Council would not risk it merely to test me. They calculated the risks, and in the end chose the only option available. You must learn to trust in the wisdom of the Council. Your destiny will come when it's appointed time. You mustn't be so impatient. Come on, come. Let's move on. There's much to be done. How can I help? Can I... Yes, what's on your mind? You got it. How may I be of assistance to you, Padawan? What is it you would like to speak to me about? Of course. Hey there, what can I do for you? No problem, just anything else. No problem, anything else. No problem, anything else. No problem, any. No problem, any. No problem, any. No prob, any. No problem, anything else. Sorry, I don't have one handy. Hey there, what? Don't worry. Okay. Welcome to Anchorhead, potential customer. Zerka Corporation stands ready to serve, after some formalities, of course. First, your ship is not on our list of planned arrivals for today. There is a docking fee of 100 credits because of this.
The immediate benefit is access to these very docking facilities. This is the only port in Anchorhead. Once you've paid, we will offer trade services as well. We're not unreasonable, we just want to cover expenses. I assure you that the fee is non-negotiable. We have a very thin margin of profit on this world. As you wish. I thought you would. Without these fees, Zerka Corporation would have closed this port years ago. This will cover any future landings as well. It's like a registration, so we can serve you better when you return. Now, as a customs officer, I can provide information on services. Is this visit business or pleasure? It depends on what level of risk you want to take. You could ask at the Zerka office if any bounties need collecting. That's in the central anchor head. While you're at the office, ask for a hunting license so you can sell trophies to Faza in his lodge, just north of them. I suppose you could also take up swoop racing. Talk to the hut at the registration office by the track. That's in West Anchorhead. I can't say I know which of these jobs is the most dangerous. I stay away from all of them. That's not much information. Could you tell me more? You a digger? I've heard of ruins being found now and then, but they've always been stripped by sand people soon after. You're not going to get anywhere with them. I guess you could ask around, but I doubt you'll learn anything different. You could always ask a Jawa. It's hard to tell what they know. As you wish. If you need anything else, I'll be here. Hey there, what can I... Don't worry. Okay. How can I help? I can try. What would you like me to recall? Then I suggest... How can I help? Then I suggest... How can I help? I can try. Then I suggest... How can I help? Tatooine is a dry planet that has not been inhabited long, and has little law. This town of Anchorhead may be its only settlement. Beyond that, there is little else I can tell you. Then I suggest... We... Hey there, what can I do for you? I always heard Tatooine was nothing but a rock covered by a bunch of worthless sand. I can't even figure out why Zerka Corp set up their mining operations here. Sorry I can't be more help, you know. Is there anything else I can do for you? Okay. Genchopa chawi tichok twiz yun kun. Watu yama kama wuna henak nek. Bugra shak kun tichi wa um chawa. Dong abuk sham. I'm Bastila, yes. I take it that you know my mother. Bona na kachu. Kicha Badwang, Wanga Kum Kiba Bu Mulera, Kakin Chak Nawagawa Bakon. Is there something I can do for you, miss? As you can see, we're in quite a hurry. Kakin Cha Na Kwat Na Bon Kon, Wana Kumbes, Chi Pala. My mother's condition. Tin Umpa Do Ponta Krita, Akti Kondo Una Chaba Chisa Wanki, Ti Toki Grantu. I've not seen my mother since I joined the order. Do you know what's happened? Did you... did you say anything about my father? Genchopa chawi ti chok twiz yun kun Watu yama kama wuna henak nek Bugra shak kun ti chi wa um cha... I see. Where did you meet her, do you remember? Cha chi don mulaka Wata yuma ka wama hona nek Ashanti... Part of me would rather not see her at all. But if she is really sick... 
Well, we shall see. Business is up a little, so leave me to my work. You never know what the Sith will do. Please, will you help me? I have nothing, nothing left. Oh, thank you. I don't have anywhere else to turn. If you're down and out on Tatooine, you're on your own. My husband was a hunter, killed out on the dunes. This raid plate is all I have left. Please, will you buy it? I don't need a handout. I just can't sell it to Faza without a license. Please, I'm worried about having it. They're so rare. I still can't believe he's gone. What do you want to know? His name is... was Ward Fisk. He used to work in the mines, but they scaled back last year. He was new to hunting, but he was a good fighter. He used to be a soldier. We spent everything on his gear. After a few trips, he didn't come back. Guards say his sandcrawler crew found his body stripped of everything. Nobody saw anything, and most of the other hunters never even knew him. He had just started. I don't trust any of them. But those Gamorians, they just laugh when they see me. I think they did it. Will you buy it? I can't sell it myself. They're worth more than 500 credits. You will? Oh, thank you so much. Please, I know it's worth at least 500 credits. Thank you. I hope it is enough. You've been a great help. I appreciate it. My children will too. Wow. Sometimes helping people feels pretty good, you know? Thank you for helping this woman. It may not seem like such a great thing to you, but you're making a difference. For whatever it means, may the Force be with you. You saved us. How can I help? Hmm? Sorry. I'm just thinking about my mother. It's strange to hear news after all this time. It's quite distracting. It's not that I look forward to seeing her. I just can't help but wonder what she wants. But perhaps we have better things to do. Ah, uh, 
Takom juice tak miki grabal mogo. Je do bado wana ni di bobo. Tong. Mucho shak pa khat. Ki ye no no da map takom juice tak miki grabal mogo. Ka je do bado wana ni di bobo. Tong na bung shak. Mucho shak pa khat. Ki ye no no takom juice tak miki. Je do bado wana ni di bobo. Get lost, Tenderfoot. I hunt Desert Raid. I don't babysit. Well, you sure know how to get on my good side. You're just trotting out bantha paths, but thanks all the same. My name is Doric Quinn. I'm a hunter. I hunt. Is that enough, or should I start listing my family birthdays? If that... Good hunting. Mm. You know, I don't really have that much to tell you. You really have to get out on the dunes yourself. You'll have to ask around. Comad Fortuna is a much more experienced hunter than I am. He hunts far from Anchorhead. The local Jawas are a good source of information, even if it is hard to understand them. It may cost you, though. Again? Well, if you want to waste your day, that's your business. I... If that's what you... Good hunting. for you. Mm. Did my wife send you? This ain't about credits, is it? Whoa, what'd you say? You know, I come here because the guards stop your kind of trouble before it starts. It's more annoying than anything. You shouldn't make threats you don't want returned. Bad move. I'm not wasting ammunition on a fight with you. I have raid to hunt. We meet on the dunes, you watch out.
Chiwi Aita ka chong chi cha Chiwa e Aita kan ki cha Ba ba La boda ni wun ki smak toma Wana kun bes ching pa ma ruli ra Tok ching bang non kit Tok ning cha muli ra ra bes Kui ami jus kun a chik tengai, yin na kun ba ma ruli ra ra chik kun, slimo pa dona, nun di hao dong da chik hong kapi. Her mother was supposed to be here somewhere. Ask if they've seen her. La boda ni wun ki smak toma, wana kun bes ching ba ma ruli ra, tok ching bang non kit. Kui ami jus kun a chik tengai, yin na kun ba ma ruli ra ra chik kun, we should try to find her. I doubt she wants to be kept waiting. Something you want? I don't have a lot of time for talk, so please make it quick. Hmm. All right, but I'm not sure what I could say to interest. I just. Want... Well, it's a hole in the galaxy, as far as I'm concerned. I doubt this outpost will last much longer. But that's happened before and will happen again. Anchorhead has been resettled a few times. Well, Tatooine fools people. It looks like it might have a good supply of resources, but it doesn't. Before a company learns this, they've already set up communities to support operations they now can't afford. The company pulls out, cities dry up, and after a few years, someone that doesn't know why it failed tries again. No one is. I guess it looked like a promising mining planet, but the metal, I tell you, just isn't right. I've been a mechanic my whole life. I've never seen anything corrode as fast as Tatooine metal. It's why whoever was here before left, and why Zerka will leave, and why whoever comes next will leave. All right, then. La boda ni wun kis toma. Wana kun bes ching pa ma ruli ra, tok ching bang non kek. Tok ning cha muli ra ra bes, uba patu konchi. Tong nong bong chang yung yang, tong katok smak del ya. Kuyami just kuna chik tenai. Ina kun mama ruli ra ra chik kun. Slimo patona. Mundi ha dong da chik hong kapi. La boda ni wun ki smak toma. Wana kun bes ching pa ma ruli ra. Tok ching bang non kek. Can I help you? These are the offices of the Zerka Corporation. I trust you have business with the company. If this is about employment, I'm afraid all regular mining positions are full. And before you ask, we are also no longer selling hunting licenses. As I said, we are no longer selling them. There are too many people cavorting about outside the walls as it is. We use them to ensure that only people judged fit by Zerka Corporation are allowed outside the city. We don't allow casual exploration because of legal concerns. 
Zerka Corporation takes no responsibility for loss of life on the dunes. It's just so we can keep track of people. No one leaves the city without a Zerka hunting license. Well, normally we charge 200 credits, but I could make an exception if you agreed to perform a task for us. It's similar to hunting. The sand people are becoming a problem. They destroy our sand crawlers and kill our miners. One particular tribe is the worst. It's as if their chieftain has decided to wage war against us. I would like their attacks terminated. Bring me their gaffy sticks as proof. If you agree to do this, I'll give you a hunting license now and pay a bounty for each stick later. I'll give a bonus for the chieftains. Which would you rather have dumped on your office floor? Besides, they're ceremonial weapons, unique to each warrior. It's just as good. Very well, though I do have work to get back to. Farewell. Zerka Corporation welcomes your future inquiries. Chua Penki, Yun Patisa, Kichuba Jikutka Naga, Kingu Mwa Muri Radwana, Kimba Nikcha Lora Kun. Chiwi Aita Ka Chong Chicha, Agi Unko Tune Chuna Muri. Greetings again from the offices of Zerga Corporation. Is this about bounties or something else? As I said, we are no longer selling them. There are two. We use them to ensure that we don't allow. It's. The sand people are becoming a problem. They destroy our sand crawlers and kill our miners. One particular tribe is the worst. It's as if their chieftain has decided to wage war against us. I would like their attacks terminated. Bring me their gaffy sticks as proof. If you agree to do this, I'll give you a hunting license now and pay a bounty for each stick later. I'll give a bonus for the chieftains. Very well, though I do have work to get back to. Farewell. Nabodaniwinkismatoma, <laughs> Kuyabi就是古纳吉的奶，伊那古纳马鲁里拉，巴博达尼文基斯马托马，我那古巴斯金巴马鲁里拉，托金巴尼诺克，托宁加鲁里拉拉巴斯，Kuyabi就是古
Lord Malak was most displeased when he learned you had escaped Taris alive. He has promised a great reward to whoever destroys you. Something you want, Spacer. Go talk to the office if you want to complain about conditions here. I don't want to hear it. Seems like every other person I meet is complaining about something. Well, it's not going to get better, so leave me alone. I don't really have any interest in helping you. Will this be quick? Nobody we've brought, that's for sure. Our expert said this rock was supposed to have mining potential to last for years. Nothing but garbage or good for nothing. You ever try to sell someone garbage? My name's Mud in three systems now. Good. Have a look. Well now, what can Gandraft do for you? It's been a while since I've had anyone bother talking to me. Usually it's some kid wondering what my old racing days were like. I was back on Taris. Seems like a long time ago. I'm not sure what I have that you would be interested in. I'm, 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 I'm just an old swoop jock that doesn't have the head for it anymore. <laughs> Uh, keep safe. Yep. Yeah. I'm sorry, do I know you? I'm here, Mother. But don't you recognize me? What do you expect when I haven't so much as had a picture of you since you left? Do you know how long I've been trying to find you? You knew as well as I communication would be impossible once I joined the Order. Now what is this about? Where is Father? Then you haven't heard. I should have known. Has something happened to him? Are you going to tell me or not? 
Your father is dead, Bastila. That is part of the reason why I was looking for you. Dead? What happened? What did you do to him? Isn't this a lovely reunion? Already she's flinging insults at me. Tell me, you're one of her friends. Do you treat your mother this way? Is that so? Well, I'll be joining her soon enough, I suppose. I was told you were sick. Are you actually dying, or is this merely melodrama for my benefit? Such sweet things, you say. Well, perhaps I should tell you everything first before we start arguing again. You could start by telling me what you got father into that killed him. I hadn't realized Jedi was so spiteful. You want me to tell you I brought your father here for an expedition, do you? You want to blame me for his death? You never accepted that your father loved going on his treasure hunts, leaving you alone with me. I was always to blame for everything. What else is new? So yes, fine. I brought your father here to look for crate dragon pearls. He took an expedition into the Tatooine desert, and he died. How can you be sure of that? Father is an experienced... Do you think I would look for you if I wasn't sure? They were attacked by a crate dragon, and one of the guides fled the battle. He saw your father killed. I see. So what do you want from me? Credits? You don't be insulting. I want you to use those senses of yours. I want you to find him. I want you to bring back his holocron. Why? So you can sell it? Is it too much to ask that I have something to remember your father by? Of course it is, isn't it? You couldn't be bothered. We're very busy on a mission from the Jedi Council. I doubt I'll have the time. Ask my companions if you doubt me. What remains would there be? Great dragons are huge predators, easily able to devour a human, and the desert is a harsh environment. Finding my father's remains would be an even more impossible task than finding his holocron. An ignoble end to a fine man. It doesn't seem to have anything to do with what she's asking. Are you actually sick, Mother? What difference does it make to you? None, I'm sure. Just find your father's holocron, and you won't have to worry about me again either way. That's the kind of response I would expect. Very well. We'll look for the holocron if we have time. I can't promise any more than that. I believe your father was headed north towards the Sand People Enclave. I would check along that route, dear. Do please hurry. Hey, Bastila. You ever use the forest just for fun? You know, a little jolt of the forest to trip up some jerk who's ticking you off? I would never use the force for such petty and trivial revenge. The mere thought of it's preposterous. Aw, oh, come on. There's gotta be times when you thought about it. Don't be so stuck up. You can tell me. I am not stuck up. I merely have the years of training to give me the wisdom and understanding to see how childish such an act would be. Childish? Is that a crack about my age? You ain't much older than me, Miss High and Mighty. Just because you're some Jedi doesn't mean you can be a prissy little... What the... Hey, that wasn't funny. I have no idea what you're talking about, Mission. Come now, we have to get going. Please, do try to be less clumsy in the future.
Statement. I see you have purchased me, Master. I find this a satisfactory arrangement. My restraining bolt will be deactivated when you take possession of me. Am I to accompany you now? Shall I kill something for you? Statement. I will enter into your service now, Master. I am certain you will make adequate use of my primary functions. My gears are practically quivering with anticipation.